This next video is a really great example of showing a team working on a hands-on workshop going round robin. The first person explains her idea, draws it, hands the post-it to the recorder who puts it up on the chart and takes a note. The next person to her right takes over, she gives her idea, her post-it goes up, she draws it. Everyone's listening and learning from each other. And then the facilitator comes in at the end and helps them, encourages them, and announces a very important point that uh, if there are competing ideas, then you simply put another piece of paper on top. You don't X out the old idea. You put another piece of paper on top and keep working. So let's watch this one. Okay, so my, my last one is um, a wetland buffer along the red cedar and that it's prote protected in perpetuity. So it's protected through um, either um, codes and ordinances or title restrictions or some way so land conservancy yep it could be any number of ways so where do we have the red cedar these days so so that would be the buffer along and you can still have trails through there um, but you would definitely need to have it on both sides and have it be protected yep with all of this, now that I can get where I want to be, and we've talked a little bit about this mixed use areas, but I'd really love to see some really nice restaurants and cultural activities, both, you know, at our band shop. So the students can come over. Great drawing, you guys. Yeah, it's really. So here we go. Some restaurants. Pretty awesome. Oh. It's a nice coffee shop. Yeah. Coffee shop. Good. Yeah. By the way, if there's any, you know, if there's competing ideas. You do what designers do. You get out another piece of paper. <laughs> yeah. But if you ever do, if someone says, you know, I really hate that idea. Let me show you how to do it. So, fine, here's a piece of paper for you. Rather like a whole than, other overlay? Ra yeah, rather That's than great. drawing over.